So what happens in the cocoon, once the co caterpillar's in there and, he's, and the cocoon has been spun, the caterpillar releases a chemical that begins to dissolve its body. And there's these little tiny clusters of cells that have been kept in an immature state for the entire life of the caterpillar that are left there while everything else is dissolving and going away. The, the body of the caterpillar literally becomes the fuel for these Im immature little cell groupings for what the, cat what the caterpillar is going to become in becoming the butterfly. And the reality is, is the caterpillar needs to just stay there and watch the process. God, who am I? Who am I? Look at this, these opportunities. They say, who am I if, they, if, if you're moving me to do something else? I don't know what this is. And he's like, would you just trust me? And allow the things that are dissolving in your life to become the fuel by which I will cause what I put in you when you were born, when you were still in your mother's womb. The purposes that I have for you that I have kept in an immature state, I will now bring and be caused to mature. But you have to just wait and let me do the process of transformation.